your first reaction finally now this end the pdp bjp alliance end well you know the the way they ended the alliance of course we knew that this was not a sustainable coalition government because it was an unholy alliance we know from the very beginning the way they fought elections and the way they came to power the fact of the matter is that the bjp has really no roots no base in the valley and through this government they tried to spread so it was not going to work today tomorrow when it will fall this is the conjecture but the unfortunate part is that firstly they have misgoverned they have governed with not true intentions of good governance and giving development to the people of jammu and kashmir the way they have moved out is also in the true bjp style of hitting below the belt and behind the back apparently they didn't even tell their coalition partner that they are withdrawing so shows that they ran away they ran away because they could not bear the situation they could not control the situation they announced unilaterally the cease fire they are blaming others but what did they do the cabinet ministers were giving different interpretations of the cease fire how can it run if you are not clear on what you are supposed to and ma'am where do you see pdp standing in this well you see the thing is that pdp i i must definitely say that pdp fell in the trap of the bjp because right after the elections there were talks i don't know if they would have uh, uh, fructified if they would have been successful but uh, at that time there were talks among the leaders of the different parties who had won 12 seats like ours or 15 like for uh, umas that we can try and work out a secular government but no pdp went at that time found bjp promises very attractive prime minister saying money will be no consideration home minister saying in 6 months we will bring peace and development to the state of jammu and kashmir we've got a kashmir policy so is there is there any hope